all my beloved students okay how are you and ready today it's time to study English again so ready yeah okay let's start all together all right uh, today teacher come back would like to introduce everyone about one grammar this grammar is about have got and has got again have got and has got okay we have learned have and has before right but today just introduce have got and has got this mean uh, when you see have got and have got it's happened in the past this mean happened already right okay so now we go to have got first when we use have got all right it's not different it's still the same we just have got with i i have got like that and in short form i've got i've got okay and we do with they they have got they have got they've got short form they've got they have got they've got right so please remember in short form also right okay and we use with we we have got we've got we have got we've got okay this how in short form and one more we use with you you have got you've got you have got you've got all right so this uh how we use have got we use with i u v d and in short form teacher have uh show you already please remember all together and teacher also have exam for example for you all right here you are i have got a flat nose i have got a flat nose right so this means you have got you have it since you was born you have got a what a flat no flat nose right here one more you have got a cute nose you have got a cute nose yeah so it's not different if you can say i have a flat nose it's also okay you have a should know it's all it's also okay but this is one way to use have got also right so so when you use have got in the sentence you have to use like that have got have got like that all right now let's go to has got has got also not different it's the same we use has got with he right like we use with has has used with he also right so he has got and in short form he's got he has got he's got all right and we use with she also she's has got she's got she has got she's got all right okay and also just with it it has got it's got it has got it's got right so i hope you remember in the full form and in the short form right how we use have and has got and teacher also have example about has got here you are she has got short curly hair she has got short curly hair all right so how we, we this how we use has got in sentence yeah? oh here here you are my brother has got big feet my brother has got big feet all right brother uh, mentioned to he yes one brother also use has got okay now we finish have got and has got and we finish how we use has got and have got also 
so now let's go to the practice okay this practice this exercise teacher would like you to think and number one yes oh it's number one okay sorry yeah it's supposed to one to five so i want you to think how we feel in the blank we feel with has got or have got okay i hope you understand let's see the first sentence i three books i three books okay so if you see i you just have or has if you remember you can do it very good no? so what okay here you are i have got three books why have got because i right okay number next uh, number two she a uh, sister she a uh, sister so if you say she you just have or has you just have or has all right think are you ready okay let's see the answer all together all right he has got she has got a sister she has got a sister all right so okay all right why has got because she right okay number three they a nice house they a nice house okay so have got or has got okay ready are you ready what is your answer okay let's see my answer together here you are they have got a nice house why have got because they right all right so number four my father a fast car my father a fast car so my father how many father one father or two father if one father you just have got or has got okay what is your answer okay okay let's see the answer all together all right my father has got a fast car why has got because one father all right the last one you a ball to play you a ball to play okay so when you see you what is your answer have got or has got all right let's see the answer yeah you have got a ball to play you have got a ball to play why have got because you okay everyone okay now you understand it's finished and this lesson is very easy and i hope you understand and later teacher will send you homework and i hope everyone can do the homework all together and all correct all right and the tomorrow we also have the lesson about have got and has got but we use in other way so see you tomorrow and please enjoy to do homework all together and don't forget to send to me goodbye god bless you everyone